It was a 2 0 win over Kingsley in town tonight. You must be absolutely delighted with that. Incredible result, you know, and to, to a man, everybody's putting an unbelievable shift. Um, not just running about, but filled with quality as well. You know, two excellent goals, could have had more first half. And then the pleasing thing, second half, you know, as game management, as a shape we had the ball tonight was, was outstanding. If we can have good shape we had the ball um, in most games, I fancy us, because we know we've got quality up the top end of the pitch to hurt teams, and uh, that's what we did today, tonight. But uh, I think to beat a full time outfit that were playing National League football um, last season, you know, it's a, it's a great scout for us. Yeah, and you, I mean, you talk about that shape. Carlton's obviously had to drop into midfield like he did second half on Saturday. He's got himself a goal as well, and he's not really looked out of place in there, has he? No, it's. Um, you know, we couldn't risk Chris. He was he was pointless doing that. You've got to put players out there, especially against teams like this, that, that who can run. You know, we knew we had to be uh, good way out of the ball tonight, and um, we certainly was. But we were creative tonight as well for the front front three. Um, you know, Parko, Jimmy, and Frank. You know, caused them all sorts of problems down the sides. We always had a runner in behind. Um, there's not a bad performance out there, is there? Everybody's played to the top of their game, and that's what we need to do more. We need to be more consistent. Uh, to move up the league, the league looks a, a tad, tad better. You know, a couple of games in hand on teams, but um, as a as a one-off performance tonight, that's that's right up there. Does that just show what happens when we do take our chances when we're on top in games? Yeah, because I think we had a chance in the first two minutes again, and didn't take it, and you just you just feel here we go again. We had it's happened so many times at home this season, uh, chances created and not taken, um, but two really good finishes. And like I say, I think the pleasing thing for me personally, the second half is as game management. You know, as a, as a back three, as a back five, we just stayed solid. We we come out of the slots when we needed to. We made good decisions. We cleared as lines as clearances were really good. Second half, we we put them under pressure. We played on the counter, and everybody absolutely worked their socks off. And that's what you need to do to win games. Yeah, they put a lot of high balls forward towards a big striker, but Connor. Andy and Tom playing together as a three for the first time, they they dealt with that really well. Yeah, yeah, I spoke to spoke to Connor before the game and you know said to him, Oh, you've obviously played in a three, yeah, no problem at all. He has been outstanding in the two games since he's come in for a for a young boy. Um his development is great. It's just what he needs as, as a young centre back. You, you know you're gonna be tested physically, you know you're gonna be tested aerially. Um sometimes these twenty three games are you know, tip tap, pass, pass, pass. If you hardly had a ball as a centre half, he knows when he comes to this level because he's played for Curzon that he's going to get tested. But um, I think having Andy Butler alongside him and, and Tom Allen as well is really, really going to bring him on. And we've spoken about the consistency or lack of it this season, but three out of four wins at home now. You must be pleased with the way we're trending here. Yeah, I think mentioning consistency, I think the performances have been fairly consistent. I think it's been the results. We've been on the wrong end of yeah, a couple of results that we deserve to lose. But, you know, even going back to Saturday, you know, it should, it should probably be a 0 0 draw. And, you know, another point away from home on the road, another clean sheet. So, performance wise, uh, I was thinking myself the other night and looking back to last season, for me, we've played a lot better this season uh, than we did last season. I think last season, what we did well last season was fight and scrap and battle win first contacts, uh, turn the game ugly. I think this season we've actually played some some attractive football. Um, certainly today, first half, you know, I thought we were outstanding. You know, balls down the side, Jimmy's linking off. We, we're giving them real problems uh, with our front three. Is it nice that we've got, obviously, back at home again on Saturday to try and build that consistency of result, weather permitting at least? Yeah, we, we, we keep saying that. We've just spoke about that in there. We, we, but we also know how difficult this league is. Um, it, it is hard. For a club of our size, um, you know, to get uh, momentum. But uh, I've just said to him in there, if we can perform like that, um, you know, on a regular basis, we're certainly going to win more games than we lose. You mentioned you didn't want to risk Chris tonight. Where is he kind of looking forward over the next couple of weeks? Uh, hopefully, he's going to be okay for Saturday. Uh, we don't think it's a poll, we think it's just real tightness in there. He's, had it. he's actually been carrying it a couple of games. And it's just, just too much on Saturday for him, so the, the, it was pointless risking him tonight. But again, you know, Carlton showed his versatility and, and slotted in there. I thought him and Bobby were, were outstanding in there. You know, in, in the air, they won second balls on the floor, made good decisions when to turn them round, when to play. Um, I think that was the key tonight. I think we just made a lot of good decisions on the ball, when to clear your lines, when to pass, when to cross. Um, you know, Max has done well in gold as well. 
you know, he's not had a lot to do really. That's how well we've defended. We've got blocks in, but what he's had to do is come and claim some some good balls, difficult balls, because they're a the big team. You know, they were a lot bigger than us from set set plays. Uh, set plays was a concern for for me and Steve. Um, but sometimes you don't have to be the biggest as long as you're the bravest. So we stuck us out on a lot of first contact in both boxes today, which was outstanding. <laughs>